Hello, hello, everybody. Welcome. It's nice to have you on this beautiful day, which is Tuesday. We're going to have another class here on Zoom. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How are you? Are you good? Yes. Are you ready for today's class? We're going to have another class here on Zoom. So thank you so much for being here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Just give me a minute while I get the presentation for you so we can start talking about what is going to be today's class. Okay. Just give me a minute so we can start. Oh, Jesus, I didn't. Jesus. Okay. Uh huh. Just give me a minute because this thing is loading. Okay. 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 We have it. I have it already. Okay, thank you so much for being here. Um, thank you, thank you for joining us. We're gonna start the class right now. Okay, so just let me get the information for you, so we can start working. Okay, let me see. Oh, yes, this one, this one, this one, this one. Okay, okay. Here we go. Okay. We're going to have class number 10 today, as you may know. We're working with section number four. That's the one we're working so far. And um, here we go. Let's get a minute. The biggest and the best. That is the number four. We're going to start working. Yes. Comparison with adjectives. Yay. We're going to work with adjectives today. So thank you so much and welcome, people. It's nice to have you one more time. Any question before we begin? Any question? Yes or no? We're going to have a comparison with adjectives. What are adjectives? Tell me, please. Anybody? Esmeralda, what are adjectives? Hello, hello. Esmeralda, Figueroa, Serrano. Tell me, please. What are adjectives? What are those? Angel, hello. Good evening. Welcome. Gabriela, Noemi. Hi, hi. Catherine, tell me, please. What are adjectives? Thank you. Welcome. What are adjectives, people? What are those? Are qualities to describe some people or things? Oh, that's beautiful. Exactly. That this is the vocabulary that we used to describe, right? Very good to describe objects. But today we're going to work into comparison. How do we compare? Yes. Uh, let me show you these adjectives here. We're going to have some rules, as you may know. Comparatives and superlatives. As you may know, these are the rules with comparatives and superlatives. Why? Long, longer, the longest. So this is the normal adjective. This is the comparative. And this is the superlative. Okay? Right? So we're going to write the comparative form and also the superlative. What is the number two? What is the comparative of the verb of the adjective cool? Uh huh. Cooler. Pretty good. Okay. Thank you. And what about what is the superlative? Coolest. Okay, the coolest. Very good. Thank you so much. What about the number three? What is um the comparative? Maybe friendly. That is correct. You are on mute, teacher. 
Teacher, you are on mute. Thank you so much. That's very good, Luis. Okay. So we have friendly or is friendlier. What do you think about it? Mm -hmm. Amigable. Oh, yes. Very good. Uh -huh. What do you think about it? Is friendly or is just like this one or friendlier like the way Luis was saying? What do you think about it? Friendlier. Very good. That is correct. Okay. Pero esta cosa no sé cómo borrarla. Oh, it doesn't allow me to like Jesus. Okay. Sorry. Uh, friendlier. Okay. What about the other one? What is the um good evening? Good evening. How are you? Fine, thank you. Sounds good. Can you? <laughs> so what is the superlative? Friendly. The exactly right. the friendliest uh friendliest like this one correct me if i'm wrong the friendliest yay that's good what about the number four heavier heavier okay heavier right very good Thank you. And what where is the superlative for? The heaviest. Oh, the heaviest. Uh-huh. Yes, pretty good. What about the other one? Nice. Nicer. Nicer, okay. Thank you. And what is the superlative? The nicest. Exactly, right? The nicest. Oh, Jesus. I have a mistake here. Nicest. Like this one, right? The nicest? Correct me if I'm wrong. No, you see. Oh, look at this one. Nicer. No, you see. Okay. No, you see. What about what is the, comp the superlative? No, the noisers. No, you see. Yes. Very good. Oh, give me a break. The noise, yes, perfect. What about all? Older. Older, right. And what about, what is the superlative? The oldest. The oldest, oldest right. Oldest. Don't forget pronunciation, the oldest. What about number eight? Safer. Safer, right, exactly, safer. And what is the superlative? The safest. The safest. Very good. The safest. Perfect. What about the number nine? Smaller. Smaller. Smaller, right? Very good. Oh, Jesus. I apologize. Sometimes I make mistakes. The smaller. What about the number? Like the, what is the superlative? The smallest. The smallest, smallest right? The smallest. Oh, one more time. Thank you. What about wet? Wet. Wetter. Wetter. Double T or just one T? Double T. Okay, the weather. And what is the other one? The weather. The weather. The weather. The weather. The weather. Very good. Weather. Perfect. Okay, so here we have comparative and superlative as well. So we have the two of them, right? Question for you. Jose Antonio Montes. Hello. Good evening. How are you? It's nice to have you one more time. Please select one of these adjectives and give me a comparative sentence and then give me a superlative sentence, please. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, you can yeah. select whatever you want, whatever oh, adjective. Okay. Mm -hmm. Uh, friendly. Okay. No, I mean, give me a sentence. A sentence. A sentence. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Uh, uh, 
my brother is Claudio. My brother is? My brother is Claudio. Friendlier? Friendlier. Uh -huh. My sister is Friendlier. Ok, ok. Primero, remember, cuando estamos comparing, tenemos que comparar between mm -hmm. two people. Ok. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, uh, so whenever you say, you say a comparative sentence, you need to think about that you are need, you need to use two people or two objects or two places or two animals, right? So you need two. And also, Jose, you need to mention those two. Yes, let's let me help you with Kenya. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, for example, my my brother is friendly. My my sister is friendly. Okay, okay but that, that's okay. Uh, but the idea is like you need to figure it out that you need to have two people. Okay, for example, uh, let's say. You told me that you can say your brother, right? So you need to pick two people right here. Your brother, yes, uh -huh. and also you, right? Uh -huh. So in the sentence, what is the beginning of the sentence? Let's say that you will use the um, the adjective that is this one, older. How do you make a sentence and you have your brother and you? How you compare you and your brother? How is how do you make a sentence comparing you and your brother? Mm -hmm. Any idea? So at the beginning, you start with the verb to be, as you mentioned, right? My brother. My brother is older than me. Exactly. Older. Oh, Jesus. Older than me. Yes, Jose? So here I have older. Sorry, I have my brother, which is this one. And I have me, okay, which is I, right? Yes. So my brother is older. So what I want you to take a look is like when we compare... We need two things, two people or two objects. So here is one, and here we have another one. Okay, it's like, for example, okay, here, let me show you something else. Jesus, okay. For example, if you have uh, a cow, right? A cow, and you can have a cat, yes? So again, you are comparing between a cow and a cat. And you can say, oh, a cow, yes, is, what is the adjective that we can use with a cow? Bigger. Uh, no, but it's, here. It's from... heavy, heavier. Okay, heavier, very good. Heavier than, than a cat. Than a cat. Yes. So I have one animal. And here I have another animal, so I have two when I compare. Or yes. a cat is smaller, is smaller than, than oh, a cow. Yes, if you want to switch, right? Or if we want to change the adjective. So you can say, oh, a, a cat is smaller than a cow. Yes? Cow. Remember, when you compare, you need two. Two objects, two animals animals two people i don't know whatever but you need to whatever you want to compare but you need to at the end yes and ursula give me a sentence using a superlative adjective please hello ursula good evening no okay. hello i'm sorry i have oh. some issues with ursula Oh, I'm sorry to hear about it. I'm sorry to hear about it. Okay, I hope that you can, you can fix that. Tell me, 
one sentence with a superlative adjective, please. A superlative. Yes. Um, let me see. Um, El Salvador is a bad country, a barrier. Excuse me? El Salvador is uh -huh. the best country of Central America. Ah, oh, that's very good, right? El Salvador. Okay. El Salvador is the best country in Central. Mm -hmm. Oh, Jesus. Central America. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I did a mistake here. I'm going to have it like, oh, Jesus. Sorry, Central America. <laughs> yep. Okay. Very good. Great job. Fantastic. So here, what is she doing? Well, she's like pretty, pretty much comparing between a group of countries. In Central America, we have like five countries. Yes. And she's comparing between those uh, five countries. And she's saying it's the best. Like Salvador is the best country in Central America. Yeah. So that is the difference. When we compare, right, we use the comparative adjectives. We need two, two objects. But when you use the superlative, you need to use in a context where you compare between a group of people. The first one is comparing between two, and the other one is comparing among a group of people. Yes? Okay, dokie. Any question about this? No, at all? Okay, don't worry. We're gonna have a video just for you to remember how this thing goes. Let's listen one more time and check. Hello and welcome back. Remember there are different types of adjectives? That's right. We have short adjectives, long adjectives, and irregular adjectives. With that in mind, now we'll study the superlative of adjectives. Please stay around and pay attention to the explanation as well as the audio program. Comparisons with adjectives. Which country is larger, Canada or China? Canada is larger than China. Which city has the largest population, Tokyo, Mexico City, or Sao Paulo? Tokyo has the largest population of the three. What is the most beautiful mountain in the world? I think Mount Fuji is the most beautiful. Adjective, comparative, superlative. Long, longer, the longest. Dry, drier, the driest. Big, bigger, the biggest. Famous, more famous, the most famous. Beautiful, more beautiful, the most beautiful. Good, better, the best. Bad, worse, the worst. Let's review comparative adjectives. We use the comparative adjectives to compare two people, places, or things. They are used in sentences where two nouns are compared in this pattern. Noun or subject plus verb plus comparative adjective plus than plus noun or object. Let's not forget what happens with short, long, and irregular adjectives. Study this chart and take notes as you do so. Take a look at these examples. They are applying the rules. My house is bigger than her house. His room is tidier than her room. The red car is more expensive than the blue one. Ready to learn about superlative adjectives? Superlative adjectives are used to describe an object which is at the upper or lower limit of a quality. They are used in sentences where a subject is compared to a group of objects. Follow this pattern. Noun or subject 
plus verb, plus the, the superlative adjective, plus noun or object. Study the chart. Just as comparative adjectives in superlative form, we also have short, long, and irregular adjectives, which you need to take into account when using them. Examples? He is the tallest of his family. Michael Phelps is the fastest swimmer in the world. Canada is the biggest country in North America. Can you write one sentence using good in its comparative form? Now write another sentence using good in its superlative form. Write both sentences in our discussion box. So this one was from yesterday, as you may know, right? And we're going to practice. Okay, look at the picture here, Gabriela. Jesus. Sorry, I forgot. Yes, that's why. Okay. I'm sorry, Gabriela Noemi Orellana. Thank you. Describe the picture. Thank you. Hello, Gabriela. Hello. Thank <laughs> no, yeah, you. <laughs> that happens to me sometimes. Tell me, please. Describe the picture. And the the house channel, <laughs> the gin channel. Oh, okay. <laughs> it is a house. Where is the house? Let's say. Where is the house? Uh huh. The mm -hmm. house. Yeah. Um, Where is that? Like in the city. Uh, in a river. In a lake. Um, the trees, the trees, uh, the arbors. Among the trees, okay, among the trees, very good. Thank you so much. So we have Keegan and Kathy. We have, so where did you go for vacation, Kathy? Japan. How exciting. Did you have a good time? It was terrific. I think Japan is the most exciting country in Asia. Asia. Well, it certainly has sun of what is comparative or superlative? Superlative, superlative because our three cities of uh, Japan Okay, so what is what is the correct option? Superlative. Okay, um, very good. That is correct. Superlative, but how how do we say that in English? The, the most interesting. The most interesting. The interesting. The interesting. The interesting cities in the world. Okie dokie. That's good. The most interesting, right? Okay. The most. Oh, Jesus. Okay. The most interesting cities in the world. The world. Tokyo, Osaka, and Kyoto. Yep. Yeah. I had. What is next? Comparative or superlative? The best. Okay, the that's best. superlative. Okay, the best. The best. The best time. Time in Kyoto. What about it's superlative or comparative? Mm, superlative. It's the most. Beautiful. The most beautiful city I've ever seen. Okay. I've ever seen. The most. Let me check the spelling. I'm sorry. Of course. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah, it's the beautiful. most beautiful city I have seen. Of course, beautiful. it is also one of the best. 
The most popular. popular. The most popular. Eggs. Practice. The most. Very the good. Most. Oh, I'm sorry. The most popular. The most popular tourist the attractions. Attraction. It, was it was the most crowded. A very good. The most crowded. I visited this summer. Crowded. What's the most crowded city I visited this summer? I've always wanted to visit Japan. What's it like in winter? Actually, I think that's the worst. Oh, very good. Regular or irregular? Irregular. 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 It's the worst. That's the worst time to visit because I don't like cold weather. However, I Mr. think in... Sorry, it's worse or worse? Oh, it's worse or worse? I did a mistake? Yes or no? The word superlative. Yeah, it is correct. I think this is the superlative, but let me know. Because maybe I did a mistake. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, let me see. Yeah. No. Yeah, I think it's correct. Remember, worse. Yeah. This worse. Okay, Perfect. worse. This one is comparative. Yes, it's comparative. Worse is comparative. It's yeah. worse than. Yeah. And this is the worst. This superlative. So I. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Sorry. That's okay, no problem. That's good. That's good. Yes, yeah, sometimes I do mistake. Yeah, just that's, that's no problem. Thank you. Uh however, I think in Sapporo now is no festival is the most the, the most fascinating. The most the fascinating, most right? Right. Yes, yeah, that's right. Festival in the world. Exactly. The most Fascinating, fascinating, uh, yes. Okay, thank you. Gabriela, usted va a ser Kathy. Yes. Kenya, Ayala. Kenya. Teacher. You are Kika. Ready, let's begin. Thank you. Uh, so, where do you go for your vacation, Katy? Japan. How exciting! Did you have a good time? It was terrific. I think Japan, Japan is the most exciting country in Asia. Well, it certainly has. Some of the most interesting cities in in the world: Tokyo, Osaka, and Kyoto. Yeah, I have the best time <clears throat> in Kyoto. It's the most beautiful city I have ever seen. Of course, it's also one of the most popular popular tourist attraction. It was the most crowded city I visited this summer. summer. I always... Esa palabra no la puedo decir. Anti. Teacher? What is pronunciation? Como what pronunciation? Wanted? Wanted. Wanted. Mm -hmm. I always wanted to visit Japan what like in the winter. Very good. Very good. Actually, I think that, that's the worst Very good. time to visit it because I don't like cool weather. weather. However, 
However, I think the Sapur Snow Festival is the most fascinating. 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 <laughs> Festival in the world. Very good. Thank you so much. That's good. Yes. Great job. Okay. Popular. Popular. Yeah. This is the word. As, as you know, here we're just working most of like the answer. I or I guess all of the answers are related to superlative. Yes. So the context always is going to be in a group of cities or places. Very good. I'm sorry. I'm gonna stop here a little bit and because I need to take the attendance. Yes. So just give me a minute. Mientras obtengo your names. And please, when you hear your beautiful name, say present or I'm here. Yay, that's good. Thank you. Okay, let's begin with Alejandra Elizabeth Duran Ramos. Alejandra Elizabeth Duran Ramos. No, she isn't. Okay, I'm sorry. <gasps> Jesus. What about Alejandra Maria Mejia Avelar? Present, teacher. Thank you teacher, so much. Yo me conecté más tarde porque me estaban celebrando mi cumpleaños, por eso. Y no oh, Jesus. Oh. Happy birthday oh. to you. Happy birthday. Gracias. Yes, look at that one. Teacher, oh. este, Alejandra está escribiendo por eso, la que mencionaba primero. Oh, in the chat? Sí, también le respondió a usted. Oh, thank you, Alejandra. And also, Gabriela, thanks for letting me know. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. I love it. Thank you. Eh, Alejandra Maria Mejia Avelar. Happy birthday, young lady. I wish you the best. Gracias. Yes, so you can uh, get a bunch of presents and a lot of money. Everybody loves yeah. money, right? Uh -huh. You can get a bunch of it. Okay. Andrea Esmeralda yeah, Flores yeah. Hernández. We're going to, to a piece of, of pie. Oh, yeah. That's right. I hope we can get one. But um, delicious, but not nutritious, right? Thank you so much. Ángel Isaac Cibrián Bonilla. I hope delicious. <laughs> Thank you so much. Angel, <laughs> welcome. It's nice to have you. Blanca Esmeralda Flores Ortez. Hello. Thank you so much, Blanca. Good evening. Nice to have you. Edgardo de Jesús Maldonado, Maldonado. Present teacher. Gentlemen, welcome. It's nice to have you. No. Uh, oh, I think I missed one. Blanca Estela Lara López. Blanca Estela Lara López. Blanca Estela Lara López. No. Okay. Alba Esmeralda Figueroa. Eh, present teacher, good evening. Thank you and welcome. It's nice to have you. Gabriela Noemí Orellana Tejada. I'm here. Wonderful. It's nice to have you. One more time. José Antonio Montes Fuentes. Thank you. Gentlemen, it's nice to have you one more time. Catherine, Joanna. Casadilla. Present. Thank you so much. Me. It's nice to have you. Kenya, Roxana, Ayala de Velázquez. Present, teacher. Thank you and welcome. Uh, Luis, Miguel Mejía. Hello, hello. Present, teacher. Nice to have you one more time. Maria Delmi Hernández de Montoya. I'm here. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Welcome. Thank you. Sandra Lisette Elizondo Merino. Present teacher. That's good. Welcome. Nice to have you. Cindy Carolina Cruz de Lopez. Here. Hello and welcome. And the last one is going to be Ursula Yamilet Cornejo. Martinez. Hello. I'm Hello, here. Hello, Ursula. How are you? Uh, so far, so good. By oh, the way, this... thank you for asking. Oh, that's great. Listen, are you happy today? I'm sorry? Are you happy today? <laughs> Honestly, yes. <yeah. laughs> oh, that's good. That's good. Yes. 
Very good. Thank you so much. Uh, we're going to continue working with this thing that is called the comparatives. First of all, we're going to have these beautiful pictures. For this one, Luis Miguel Mejia, please describe these uh, places, please. Thank you so much. Uh, this picture is uh, paisajes. <laughs> uh, this is a um, desert. Desert or desert? A desert. Uh, desert. Um, a fault or water? Uh, uh, water. Mountain. Fault? Mountain. A mountain. Uh, the Swiss Canal. What is called? Sorry. Continue. Continue, uh, please. Thank you. Fall cascada, no. Oh Jesus, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jesus, I don't know what happened. Okay, just give me a minute. <laughs> okay. Le apreté a little bit there, and then everything like. Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, Luis, okay? Sometimes these things happen. Okay, back to this. Keep, keep describing, please. Okay, there are three pictures. In one is a desert. Uh, in a, another is a river or fall. And another... Uh, one a canal <laughs> that is right this is a desert a desert desert yes a desert, desert Remember... is a pie exactly like that one okay a dessert is like that one. this is the the desert the desert right the desert es más fácil pronunciarlo cuando decimos the desert right the desert yeah that's, that's easier i guess okay. this is a waterfall as you were saying very good and this waterfall. is a canal right that's what it says here, okay? So thank you very much. That was very good. We're gonna complete this conversation. Oh, I'm sorry, it's not a conversation. Alejandra, a velar. Alejandra, a velar. Alejandra, a velar. Alejandra, a velar. Hola. Hello, Alejandra. Alejandra. <laughs> okay, I'm oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, okay. So, vamos a, a let's say to complete this this um comparative and superlative sentence. In parentheses, we have some adjectives. Is generic, right? Love. Uh, here we have some information. Miles. Uh, anxious wet and so on and so on so let's begin with number one yes measurements thank you uh well it's not number one right because we have number one and number two done already so we're gonna work with number three uh bad weather passing in california death Bali is the lowest low point in north america the South Canal, uh, Suez Canal, joins the Mediterranean and Red Seas. It is 190 kilometers, 118 miles. Oh, look at this one. Tenemos in kilometers y luego nos dicen in miles, right? Esto porque from the U.S. No. they work with miles. And here, like, Latin American, Europe, and everywhere they were with kilometers. Uh, it's longer than the Panama Canal. What about the number three? What is the correct um, option? It is superlative or comparative? Superlative. Very good. Superlative. That is so what is what is the correct? What is the... It is the weather. Oh, weathers. perfect! Beautiful. The weather is very good. Just give me a minute so I can write it down. Yay! 
the weirdest, right? Okay. The weirdest place on earth. We're going to have number four, please. Falta la tesis o no? Oh, yes, that is correct. Thank you. That's very nice of you. Letter T. I forgot the letter T. Okie dokie. Thank you. What about the number four? Canada and Russia are countries in the world. The most large. The largest. The largest. Oh, the, the, largest. La largest. the largest. The largest. Very good. The largest. Beautiful people. Yes. What about the number five? Russia is larger than it's Canada. Larger. Larger than Canada. Okay, okay. It's larger so, than Canada. Okay, is larger. Very good. So this is comparison. Larger than Canada. Oh, perfect. Yeah, you got it. It's larger than Canada. What about the number six? Oh, this one is good. This one is good. Waterfall in the world. The highest. Oh, very good. The highest. What is the highest waterfall in the world? The highest. The highest waterfall in the world is in Venezuela. Not El Salvador, but in Venezuela. What about number seven? The Atacama Desert. Atacama Desert. The driest. The driest. The driest. The driest. The driest. Driest. Yes. It's the driest. Very good. Thank you so much. The hottest. The hottest capital. Capital. Very good. The hottest. Hottest. The hottest. The hottest. 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 Like this one? Perfect. Wonderful. What about the number eight? No, no, sorry. Number nine. The coldest. The coldest. The coldest. Any other. Is the coldest. Is this coldest. Uh, any other. Is the colder. Is colder than any other. No, no, the coldest. Is the, the coldest. Is the coldest. Is the coldest. No, the coldest. coldest. No, it's cold, coldest. Okay, because it's like the, the continent the of Antarctica is the coldest. Any it's other coldest. place in the world. Oh. In the is is colder than any colder in than any other place in the world. It's colder than than any other place in the world. That is correct. The Northern, the Antarctic. I'm sorry. It's colder. Colder than. than. Very good. Any. It's colder than any yeah. other place in the world. Very the good. Malaya. The most dangerous mountain climb. Very good. To, to climb. Yeah. Most. Dangerous. 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 Yes. The Mountains. highest. The highest. Is the highest. Mm. Um, the Swiss Alps. No. So comparative or superlative? Number 11. Is the is higher than the mother her in the Swiss higher than oh. the mother um, and the Swiss that is correct higher higher than higher than higher than um the man mother horn in the Swiss Alps very good what about number twelve is deeper than the Atlantic Ocean. 
That is the correct. The Pacific Ocean is yep. deeper, is deeper than Atlantic. Deeper than, okay. So here we have, as you may know, a combination of comparatives and superlatives. Please, okay. Andrea Esmeralda Flores. Hello, hello. Yes, teacher. Welcome. Please read the sentences, all of them. Thank you. Okay. But, but where basing in California, State Valley is the lowest point in North America. The Swiss Canal joins the Mediterranean and red seas in 190 kilometers, 180 miles long. It is longer than the Panama Canal. Mount Wildlife in Hawaii gets 1,117 centimeters. 416 inches on ray a year it's the weather's wet place on air. Canada and Russia are the largest country in the world. Russia is larger than Canada. The highest hairfall in the world is in Venezuela. The Atacama desert, desert is Chile is in Chile is the driest place in the world. The hottest capital city in the world is Muscat Oman. The continent of Antarctica is colder than any other place in the world. The Himalayas are some of the most dangerous mountain, mountains to climb. Mount Black in the French Alps is higher than the Matterhorn in the Swiss Alps. The Pacific Ocean is deeper than the Atlantic Ocean at one place. The Pacific Ocean is 11,033 meters. Yes. Uh, meters. Meters. Uh -huh. The 36 South. 36,198 feet deep. Beautiful. Thank you so much. A few mistakes. For example, we have dries. Um, also, try to make the passes, right, when you read. So you can pronounce better the, the, the words, right? For example, um, let me see. Teacher, como es 11,033. Yeah, 11,000. Ah, okay. 33 meters. 11,033 meters. Here also we have 118 miles. 118 miles here. Very good. Thank you. Also pronunciation was very good. Andrea, keep working like that because you're doing it very good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let me show you the next material so we can continue working on this one. Okay. We're gonna have some, let's say, information about some aspects. Yes. About like this one. Imagine these people are planning to visit your country, right? Imagine that this Jana, Neil, and Sami are planning to visit El Salvador, right? Yes. What would they enjoy doing? agree a recommendation for each person. So we have three recommendations, okay? Oh, I'm sorry, my mistake. We have three people here in this in this uh, information, right? For that one, uh, Alejandra Avelar. Alejandra Avelar. Hello, Alejandra. Hello. Usted va a leer esta que está acá, right? Esta, la primera. Then, José. Lo de Jana. Usted va con Jana, ok. Uh, Alejandra, José, usted va con este in the middle. And Sandra, Lisette, Elizondo, Merino. Usted va con Sammy. Ready? Let's begin. 
are like are kids of of two actively especially especially hiking hiking and, and, and bike bike, bike I got riding right riding I can't I can't find crowded crowded and polluted and polluted cities very good thank you so much jose antonio thank you this one in yellow jose antonio in yellow okay i uh, enjoy this person museum uh try local food and uh, shopping at the small store i don't like worrying to this place Thank you so much, Sandra. Sammy, I love nightlife. My favorite activity is going dancing and meeting new people. I really don't like small towns. Thank you so much. Okay, so these are like these people that are visiting, let's say a country. And well, they like love doing different stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. What are the activities that Jana loves to do? Um, Angel Isaac. What are those activities that Jana loves to do? Mm -hmm. Isaac, can you participate? No? Okay. What about you? Maria Delmi Hernandez, please. What are the activities that Jana loves to do when she gets the chance? Oh, uh, what activities? Yes, please. Uh, uh, she likes what kinds of outdoor activities? Uh, speciality hiking and bike riding. Um, uh, uh, she can stand in a crowd in polluted cities. Thank you so much. Maria Delmi, uh, do you do hiking or or like riding bicycles? Uh, I love I love hiking, but riding bike uh, not too much because but you can. Uh, uh, I, I would say here is is it's dangerous because oh. there's no no not, not much safe. respect to 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 to, to bike. Okay, what about what about the opinion? I can stand crowded and polluted cities, uh, Maria Delmi. Do you agree or do you disagree with uh, this? I'm agree. Okay, explain I'm your agree. answer, please. I uh, I like I like the um, um, the those uh, um, uh, um, uh, um, uh, um, clean spaces or clean areas. Yeah, yeah, and and. Um, I I can I can do noise in places. No, um, no, I don't. I don't like very noise noise in uh, places. That's right. And That's right. I don't do, I don't like um, crowded. Oh, crowded that places. that crowded yeah. that crowded thing nowadays is everywhere, right, Maria Delmi? Oh uh, yeah, in in the city, yeah. But I like to to go out to out, out of San Salvador. Sounds pretty yeah. good. Not not the carretera los Choros, right, Maria Delmi? Not not no. like. <laughs> no, I don't like the carretera los churros because it's heavy. 
Not at all. Oh, that's good. Thank you so much for sharing that. Very good. Thank you. Kenya, what about this one? Okay. This is, I enjoy visiting museums. Do you like visiting museums, Kenya, Roxana? Yes, I like. Oh, how often do you go there? Uh, <laughs> al, al tiempo sería uh, once in a while yeah once in a while once in a while once, once in a while once in a while okay very good okay very good what about shopping at small stores what do you think about that do you do that Kenya? No, you... no, 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 no much, no much. Okay, as, as small stores, right? Okay. And what about the last expression? I don't like boring tourist places. Do you agree or do you disagree? I don't like. Oh, so one more time. Do you agree or do you disagree? I'm sorry, teacher. I don't understand your question. Oh, okay, very good. So the expression is, I don't like boring tourist places. Do you understand? ¿Entiendes esta frase? I don't like boring si and tourist places. No. Mm -hmm. Boring um, significa? Aburrido. Aburridos, como los lugares aburridos. Es aburrido el place. El place is aburrido, boring. right? Yes, boring. boring. <laughs> oh, okay. Ahora yo le pregunto, do you agree or do you disagree? Okay, el primero es estar de acuerdo, entonces el otro es this. Desacuerdo. Es lo opuesto. Estar de acuerdo o es estar de acuerdo. Mm -hmm. Estar de acuerdo o en desacuerdo pues, con esa frase que dice al final. I don't like boring tourist places. Yes, I do. Yes. I agree, okay, yes, I agree, I agree. okay, o en el caso, pues está en desacuerdo, you can say no, I oh, I'm sorry, agree. I disagree, yes, I, I disagree. disagree, yes, right? I, uh... yes, I agree, or you can say, I disagree, thank you so much, thank very you. good, we're going to have another one, which is, uh, let me see, Oh my gosh. Oh, let me see. No. Andrea Esmeralda. This says, I love nightlife. What do you think about it? Do you do you like nightlife? Uh actually um I studied like at night um and I just don't know. <laughs> nightlife. Mm -hmm. Nightlife. Yeah. Nightlife is like, for example, go to the parties at night. Yeah. For example. <laughs> yes, that's right. right. Uh, uh, I, uh, I don't. Oh, you don't like it? Nah, I know. Oh, okay. I thought like you were like saying, oh, yes, I love it. Okay. <laughs> but not right. Okay. How old are you, by the way? Oh, what is what is this? Uh, oh, I think oh, I thought I think we got like Alejandra. Excuse me. How old are you, by the way? Andrea Esmeralda. Andrea Esmeralda. How old are you? I twenty two years. And you don't you don't like nightlife? That's... No, I neither. No. Look at that, people. Oh, That's... <laughs> no. yeah because I, I thought you were older so that's why and then I can realize oh that's why my my, my nights are study a lot um... oh so you study oh that's yeah. very good right that's very good yes okay yes yes I'm sorry to get into that one I know it's not my business but um yeah so I, I thought like you were older but you're John 
and that's that's where so my respect to you because everything you're doing is 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 good okay keep working like that um what about oh jesus the time is over okay yeah. so at night life ahorita is go to bed sleep rest and we will see you tomorrow okay yeah. thank you so much I'm for I'm being here I'm good night, good night. Take night. care. Good night, everybody. Bye -bye. Thank you. Thank Great you job. Yeah. Thank you so much.